Welcome back. Suppose that you want to add a new field such as the phone number here uh, and also the salary for every single employee. How would you do this? Well, to do this, you need to open the database first, the table, and then click on structure and then here add a new column. So I'm going to add two new columns. After the country, I'm going to add two columns. The first column is for the salary. Salary. And the salary, I'm going to make it as a text because the salary is, is going to be different from uh, one employee to another. The second input is the phone number. I'm going to say phone. And it's going to be integer. The values will be, by default, the values are null. So here null and here null. And then I'm going to click on save. So now we have two. If you click on, if you click on browse, you'll find that we have two more columns. Now we need to integrate these two columns in our application, in our code. So to do this, we need to open first the fetch. And then in the fetch, we need to get the salary. I'm going to say here th. Th, and then I'm going to say salary. Salary. And then below the salary, I'm going to say th. And then I'm going to say phone number. Phone number or just phone. And then here below the country, I'm going to here say, I'm going to copy this line. And then I'm going to say, I'm going to paste it twice. And then I'm going to say salary. Salary and also phone. Next, we need to integrate these two in the create create um, uh, .php. In the create.php, we need to have two more columns. So, I'm going to copy this code and then I'm going to paste it two times. Here and here. And then I'm going to say, instead of post the code, this one, I'm going to say salary, salary, and the name is obviously salary and the the um, the second one is phone and the name is phone and next step is that we need to do the same to the to the um, uh, update. So in the update, I'm going to open the update.php and then I'm going to, uh, before I work on the update, let me open the uh, uh, create info.php and then we need to get the salary and the uh, here, we need to say, we need to get the salary as well as the phone number. So I'm going to say and and then salary, salary and phone and then we need to create two variables here salary is equal to post salary and then phone is equal to post post phone And then we need here to say name, address, city, country, postal code, and then comma, and then salary, and then comma, and then font. And then we need to append here, we need to say comma, and then salary, and then comma, and then font. And we are done. The last step is that we need to do the same to the update. So in the update, we need to have here two more column, two more fields. So I'm going to copy this and then I'm going to paste it two times. And then I'm going to say salary, salary here. Salary. And phone. Phone here and phone here. And in the update.info, we need to say here, we need to copy this. And then we need to say and, and salary. 
and phone and here salary I'm gonna copy this and then I'm gonna say salary salary and then phone 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 here whenever we want to update we need to say we need to say comma and then salary is equal to single quote double quotes and then dot dot and then double quotes and then single quote and then in between we need to say salary and then comma and then phone phone is equal to single quote double quotes dot dot and then double quotes and then single quote and then in, in between we need to save font and we are done let me save and let me test let me head on over to the browser and refresh and as you can see we have the salary and the phone and they are empty so let me here update I'm gonna say here salary for example 10,000 and phone 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 let me click on submit and as you can see I have inserted the salary as well as the phone number and whenever we want to create an, a new employee we need to type the salary and the phone so here I'm gonna say new 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 York uh, USA and then salary 5000 and then phone number let me click on submit and it worked successfully and a new employee has been inserted